Hey guys, it's Lee Cole here. And I decided to uh, start a new playlist. This one I want to be all about LinkedIn marketing. There's a ton of stuff to know about LinkedIn. It's one of the best platforms that I personally use for two of my businesses. And I want to get you guys hip on it. So I think I'm looking at about six or so videos in this playlist. Uh, I'm sitting, you know, you probably figured out by now that I love making videos outside. I'm sitting at Starbucks. I, I would lift up my coffee and show it to you, but if I did that, then all my stuff would blow away. So let's talk about LinkedIn. In this playlist, what we're going to cover is the following. Your profile. We're going to cover how LinkedIn actually works mathematically because you really have to understand that in order, in order to understand what you're doing messaging, connecting with people, uh, how to do content marketing, all that stuff. So this is the first video of this series. And as I build out these videos, you're definitely going to work, want to look at the rest. I don't know where you're looking at this video on, if you're on my blog, if you're somewhere else, if you're on, but, but if you're on YouTube, then uh, go find the playlist and look at the whole thing as we build it out. So first things first. Let's talk about getting started with LinkedIn. And I keep, I apologize, I keep looking over here because the wind is really high. And uh, I'm so scared that all my stuff is going to blow away, including my glasses. And uh, um, hang on a minute. And so, so, so I'm putting them in my shirt so they don't blow away because legally uh, I can't drive. I guess I could squint. But anyway, all joking aside, let's talk about the first thing that needs to happen after you open up a LinkedIn account. And that is to get your profile straightened out. Well, to get your profile straightened out, you really have to understand why you're there. I mean, in general, there are two groups of people on LinkedIn. There are people who are... Their employees, their that you know, for them, LinkedIn is uh, basically a place to hang a resume, and um, you know, so so their profile is something to um, something to uh, attract, you know, potential employers with. You know, maybe they want a new job. Maybe they're just preparing for, I mean, I think the average person stays at the average job something like three years now or something ridiculous like that. You know, so they're getting prepared for that or whatever. But, you know, that group of people, um, I mean, that, that's, that's, you know, got to be hundreds of millions of LinkedIn users. That's not the, really the group of people I'm talking about. The other group of people, people more like me, like you, people who are using LinkedIn for business, these would be um, entrepreneurs, solopreneurs, lifestylepreneurs, writers, authors, uh, small business people, including the whole vast world of salespeople, real estate agents, insurance agents, and all that. These are the people that you need to use LinkedIn for marketing purposes. And whether you're selling your own product, whether you're selling houses, whether you're selling you know, your, your company's product, you need to understand how LinkedIn works from a marketing point of view. That's what I want to talk about in this set of videos. So your profile. Number one, you got to get it straight. Why you're using LinkedIn? What are you selling? What it, What is your business? So if you will look at my profile, which hopefully I'll remember to link to from this video somewhere, you will see that uh, it talks all about my software business because that's what I use LinkedIn for. Uh, if you're an insurance agent, you, your profile needs to focus on the fact that you're an insurance agent. If you, you know, you sell real estate, ditto that. If you're a public speaker, ditto that, right? So that would be step number one. You need to figure out the overall goal. Number two, there are several things that you've got to get in place. Number one is your picture. I see some god awful pictures on LinkedIn. Now, I'm not saying everybody has to wear a three piece suit. God knows I don't right but uh, I am saying that your picture needs to match what your target audience thinks someone in your business looks like okay so if you're in a business of selling commercial real estate you need to look like a commercial real estate agent if you're in a business of being a 
uh, sort of an off-the-wall public speaker, then you need to look like an off-the-wall public speaker. If you're a uh, lifestylepreneur as I am, then it's okay for you to look like that, look like a guy wearing a t-shirt who makes a lot of money, right? And um, so number one, your picture. Number two is the profile summary. Now, I refer to the profile summary as your silent salesperson. Your profile summary is the thing that virtually everybody who connects with you, who finds you and they're considering connecting with you, who you may be selling to in the future, everybody's going to read that profile summary, at least scan through it. And so you've got to get that profile summary so that it talks about you in a way that's appealing to your target market. There are a couple of ways to do that. Number one, you need to do it in first person. I see a lot of profile summaries in third person. Uh, Lee is a, uh, you know, Lee owns a software company and blah, 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 and he does this and he does that. That utterly sounds stupid. That's not LinkedIn. LinkedIn is a, is a networking platform. So you want to talk in first person because you're trying to make an emotional connection with other people. So get your profile summary in first person. Make it, you know, you want it to be about your business, but you want it to have enough life stuff in it so that you humanize yourself, right? So um, now you don't need to, I mean, you've only got, I think it's 2000 characters or something like that. I mean, you don't have that much room but you have enough room to tell a little bit of your story. So tell a little bit of your story, how you ended up where you are, what your goals and dreams are, and then focus on the benefits and features of what you sell, especially the benefits. What does what you sell do for your customer or client? What do they get out of it, all right? So get the profile summary straightened out. The next thing you wanna do is you want to, uh, you know, you wanna get your recommendations straightened out. All right, uh, you don't need many recommendations. One or two or three will suffice. Uh, I'm gonna have actually a whole video about a little more about the profile summary and recommendations because I think really this deserves going into in more depth. I'm just trying to give you an overview in this video. But uh, get the recommendations straightened out. In other words, get some recommendations. Hit up people uh, on purpose and say, hey, would you recommend me? Actually write a recommendation, okay? You want the rest of your profile. Uh, you want the rest of your profile filled out as, as much as you can. Uh, you want past employment history. You want where you went to school, and don't get all upset if you didn't graduate from college. You know, if you uh, had a string of jobs that are really different from what you're doing now. Nobody cares about that anymore, and that's really the story of everybody and not just you, you're not special. Maybe 30 years ago, that would look a little special, but nowadays that's not special at all. That's pretty much par for the course for most people. So you wanna get that straightened out. LinkedIn actually has a little feature um, on, you know, where, where they show you, you know, how much of your uh, profile summary you've got filled out. You wanna fill it out until you're at what they call an all-star level. And then from there, it's just marketing. And we will get into the marketing section and more videos in this particular playlist. So that's how you get started. Keep looking at the videos in this playlist and you will understand uh, what you need to do in order to start really using LinkedIn to create a real business. Again, my name's Lee Cole. As you've been watching this, you've probably seen notifications and things up above click on those those will take you to cool websites where you can download stuff also if you're on youtube just scroll down look at the description click on the link there that will take you to a place where you can download some stuff and learn some more about me talk to you soon hope you're doing great